Well, tonight, a Greater Boston starts with enriching the lives of our students one puzzle piece at a time. The Cambridge Ringe and Latin School community completed the world's largest hmm. jigsaw puzzle, an incredible feat in and of itself. But as WBZ's Mike Sullivan reports, it's what these students learned in the process that will be with them for the rest of their lives. In a puzzle, each piece matters. In a school, each child does too. Everything is part of everyone. From a sports team to a group project, it can take the collective to achieve a goal. We've all been working on this for like 11-ish months. We are talking about one of the largest jigsaw puzzles in the world. A portion sits under the nimble fingers of Aniket Srivastava. I enjoy just like the peaceful quality. To complete this, it took roughly a quarter of the student body at Cambridge Ringe in Latin. At 60,000 pieces, that's about 240 pieces a student. I've been down here like <laughs> gymnastics all over trying to get everything to fit together. So Emily Houston came up with the idea. The teacher fancied herself a puzzle aficionado. I do so many puzzles myself every year. Last year I did about 80. Um, <laughs> yeah, that look. The puzzle came in 60 sections. She asked staff members to host a portion. Different classrooms, some of them whipped right through them, brought them back, you know, sections back to me within like a week or two. Others took six months to do a section. What does this depict? Obviously, this is Australia. What are we looking at in totality? <laughs> in totality, it's scenes from different, like, well known parts of the world. The students began to problem solve, some strategizing with people they never spoke to before. I never really pay attention to shape and more pay more attention to color. Now that it's complete, Emily thought about hanging it. I don't know how much glue it would take to put this thing together and then how much it would weigh. Like it might bring a whole wall down with it. Instead, they will break it down so they can try it again in a few years or maybe even go bigger. 60,000, maybe 70,000. If you can dream it, they can build it. In Cambridge, I'm Mike Sullivan, WBZ News. 60,000 pieces. That is so impressive. You know what the key is? It's Amazing. take one piece and put it in your pocket, and then everyone finishes, <laughs> and then you have that final piece. In our house, the dog eats it. <laughs>